Virgo ascendant uh, Rahu transiting uh, through uh, Minai is kind of a very permanent uh, placement. It's a time period for career changes. Uh, this can, like I've seen uh, Rahu transit through 10th house, perhaps you might be getting more, uh, a better opportunity at work or some kind of career changes also are happening. Changes is typically the case with Rahu transiting through the 10th house. Perhaps you might even get more promotion or some kind of recognition at work also. Uh, perhaps like uh, definitely Rahu transiting through the 10th house can also mean a lot more visibility, uh, especially in foreign lands. So perhaps this can be an opportunity to travel to foreign lands for work calls. Um, one more thing is to uh, definitely there might be a more interest in um, a routine or a lot more interest in writing or even taking up classes uh, for the sake of your work. Say you were interested in getting a certification, uh, which is actually Mercury. So this is a good time period uh, for um, for uh, Virgo ascendant. So like uh, you might uh, be interested in getting new certifications, perhaps getting a new license or you know short term courses, being enrolled in uh, occult courses, even uh, things like that is possible. Lost in technology can also happen uh, for uh, for work. Definitely, this is this is also an important time period to. Um, be there for your mother because Ketu is transiting through your fourth house um, during this time period. There can be some kind of shift in residences also because Ketu is transit through fourth house. Usually, this can be a time period when um, you might be more inter- you might be bringing in spirituality or spiritual energies into your home also. So, Ketu in fourth house typically shows a Ganesha might be there, which is there in the home. So, during Ganesha Turti festival, a chance for you to be celebrating, you know, bringing in the Ganesha into your home. So that nature is possible. Uh, mm-hmm. Or some kind of spiritual spiritual energies into your home is possible with Ketu in 4th house. Uh, one thing with uh, Ketu house is also the theme of um, uh, continuing with your mother. Uh, so, some, so some themes of uh, you might be continuing with past life mothers. You might also be continuing with um, uh, past life family members also. So some kind of separation from family members can come up. Same time, you might be continuing with family members who were separated from before also. Um, this could be the extent of lifetime also during this time. Especially when you travel upon pilgrimages or uh, especially when you travel uh, to foreign lands also when Ketu is transiting foods. Um, yeah, that's what I have for Virgo, Dr. Pai. So for Virgo, I would say, um, you know, some of these people might meet some a friend, a long lost friend, you know, they might meet during this transit that they have not met for maybe, you know, sometimes even for 18 years or 20 years. Uh, their college mate, somebody, they will bump into somebody, you know, they might go out for a drink or for a meal together. So do, you know, those themes are very, very prominent because Ketu will come in the fourth house. It's also about friendship. Um, also, what I would say is uh, for, um, um, again, um, people have to be more careful about their liver and their kidneys, people in this, uh, you know, for Virgo essence. So also what I would say is, um, you know, water related, waterborne ailments might be, you know, bigger. So you have to watch out for that. And uh, definitely Rahu in the 10th house. Um, opportunities for travel overseas or to another place in the same same country so they might have a change in location and also i would say um, also you know sometimes they might also go through some um, elements of dispute at their work because of the sixth lord rahu you know transiting in the 10th house um, you know, some scandals or some disputes or something. So please, you know, uh, keep an eye out for not getting into anything which is messy. So do all your activities um, as per law. Um, so you would find a lot of, uh, you know, scams, especially financial scandals and scam coming out for uh, Virgo ascendants. I mean, around that time, I would say. So that's my take for Virgo ascendants.